The move today comes just weeks after another huge global financial services provider Prudential, with assets under its management in the excess of 1.4 trillion US dollars, acquired Goldstar's life insurance business. According to UAP officials, the developments offer a platform and the needed resource to deepen insurance penetration in the country. We think that we need to be innovative in the way we tap the opportunity that is unfolding. Hence, the integrated financial services model, because we think that if you, if you look at the level of access to banking services, it's probably ahead of insurance services. So if we have a bank within the group, we can then leverage their distribution platform to, to cross-sell to those banking customers. So bank assurance is a key part of how we see this unfolding. Uganda's insurance penetration levels remain wanting, while bank accounts are still seated at 6 million, a factor observers say is pulling in global players, keen on filling the near vacuum space. Given the unfolding picture of the economic reality in the region, there's going to be increasing need, both from individuals and households, but also entrepreneurs, small businesses and corporates for financial solutions. And so, as the economy grows, as disposable income grows, there's going to be more uh, opportunity for financial services. We'll, we'll be able to increase insurance penetration. You know, um, when the industry is small, consumer awareness tends to be limited. Through this competition which is emerging, there'll be greater consumer awareness the developments come at the time when Uganda and some regional countries have discovered oil and as several global financial institution reports are painting a good picture about the region's potential. Ingrid Nantege, NTV Business.